Good morning, YouTubers, refiners, scrappers, and, uh, you know, people that are generally interested in uh, watching YouTube stuff. Uh, today, did I say scrappers? Anyway, we're going to feed the silver cell. And in this silver cell, we're going to put, this is silver solder from air conditioning joints. This is a little bit of silver on that contact. There's another one. This was left over from when I used weak sulfuric acid and a little bit of nitric to get stuff off and this is going to be my anode bar when i cover it up you can see we're running out of material there and my uh, wattage and amperage have dropped off so i have to fix that uh this copper plated stuff this stuff that i put in here is still still going yet got a little bubble formation there kind of like that it's kind of cool We've got that silver cement to pour some shot. And I have a little egg that I have to melt up that came out of the silver cell basket. And a little bit of chloride there. We still have to boil that down. But that's what we're going to do. I'm going to put this stuff to recap into the silver cell. I'll probably scrap a couple of microwaves. I did some yard work today, so I get a little bit of goof off time excuse me, refining time, so, and scrapping, so that's it, we'll uh, get back at you. All right, uh, these are my papers, and, uh, man, I see a circuit board in there too, I don't know what to tell you about this, anyway, I guess that we're going to call this our sweeps and paper incineration, and uh, this has been sitting here for a while, just, I got to knock it out, it's a little windy, I don't know how well it's going to go, but I really want to ash that a little bit better. We'll screen it and then uh, use wet chemistry to go at it. So there's a little update on that. That's been sitting for a while. Just got to get rid of it. This is where I let my silver chloride settle out. I uh, have this to put in here. And then what I do is sometimes I boil it down. I'm so backed up. I put it in here and uh, I cement the copper out with an iron. So you can see that gets treated next. I usually have to um, raise the pH up a little with either hydrochloric acid or lye and then dispose of it at my waste treatment center. But that's it, the copper on that. Doesn't look too bad. See it comes off pretty easy and then settles down. So I'll have to pour that off and uh, treat it soon. Let's take a moment to look at this. Uh, see this burgundy color here? That's the copper that was in that um, silver egg. And it, I'm not going to lie, man, it's got a gold color to it. I'm not sure if there was a little gold mixed into it or that's the copper content. See, that's uh, not usually the way I like the silver to look when I run it through but you know we'll just treat it as dirty some purple in there too but I think that's from that burgundy it's a funny colored shot to me I'd run that through the silver cell and it was an egg so I wouldn't think there was that much copper and I know there's not that much copper in that crucible so maybe there was a little bit of gold on that I don't know we can always hope right but <clears throat> I think I'm going to remelt this one and then I have that to pour. I might pour that in the bar. We'll see how it looks. I could tell this when it was smoking up a little that it had some copper in it. Uh, normally the silver burns really clean. And I thought that egg was a higher pure, a higher content. But, you know, that's not too bad. I'm going to cast that into some smaller grains. 
Let's see, it's kind of greens I like. But, all right, let's try it again. Sorry about that, that'll have to be edited. So I put a piece of borax in it so it won't blow out when I heat it up. Didn't like the way it's not sticking together and I had to put my respirator on because I was producing more fumes and I'm downwind of it. So here we go, we're gonna go back at it. A little editing mishap on that, sorry guys. get some of that slag out of that melt dish all right that's not too bad i have to turn off my tanks i'm gonna leave that little bit of that slag and some small pieces of silver i'll just uh pour that off and put that debris in the bottom into my sweeps pile but that's it i gotta go check on those uh, incineration 
project I have going on in the backyard.